Guess what we're doing today? We are going to be going fidget hunting at Spirit Halloween because I heard from so many people that apparently they have fidgets there. And at first I'm like, girl, there's no way. But then I looked it up on TikTok and YouTube and I was like, holy moly, apparently there actually are fidgets in some Spirit Halloweens. So today we are going to be going there together to see if I have a lucky store. I really hope that I do because girl, if I if I find fidgets at Spirit Halloween, I think I may just become deceased. Like they will be able to use me as one of their new animatronics because I will die on the spot and that will be the end of me. Hi, Lucky. But for real, you guys, this video is going to be so much fun and I am so curious to see what they're going to have inside of the store. So if you guys are excited about this video, then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up before we get into it. And also, I'm going to give you three seconds to click subscribe and turn on post notifications so you're always notified whenever I upload a brand new video. So, excuse me. Here goes the countdown. Three, two, one. Time's up. If you guys were able to click subscribe and turn on the post notification bell in three seconds, then comment down below a whole bunch of fall leaves because as you can tell, we are in the spirit today. But anyways, guys, without further ado, I am going to snap my fingers and I'm going to be at, hi Lucky. I'm going to be at Spirit Halloween and ready to take on this fidget hunting challenge. So here we go. We made it. There's the sign, Spirit Halloween. I'm so excited. Let's go see what they have. Go to the fun section in just a second but first we gotta get scared <laughs> don't watch this if you don't want to be scared oh i have an idea with each animatronic that i go to you guys have to rate it on a scale of one to ten of how scary it is all right and i'll do the same so let's do this clown first hello mr skeleton all right let's see I just love hitting you bozos with my hammer! <laughs> okay, that's rude, sir. Watch out, or I'm gonna walk you over the head, too. I'd say he was a 5 out of 10. He wasn't too scary. Let's see what this one does. Whoa. You wanna do it? I'm too scared. Thank you. Just as all the others have. Now that I have you, your soul will be mine forever. Yeah, that one was a little bit scarier than the first one. He was probably like a nine out of ten. That was a lot of fun. I think the scariest one, in my opinion, was probably the second animatronic. But comment below and let me know which one you guys thought was the scariest. We're actually not done yet though. There's more towards the front of the store. I love this. I was terrified to go into stores like this until I was like 10 years old. Not even kidding. I was so scared of these things. And there are all these little kids that are braver than I am. Okay, let's look at this guy back here. Oh, he's so cute. Let's try him out. <laughs> eh. He wasn't really that scary. He was literally, like, on a scale of 1 to 10 of how scary he was, he was literally probably a 2. The music was scarier than anything, so... <gasps> Look at him. Now he needs a makeover. You need to be cut. <laughs> that was actually really, really disturbing. I said, now he needs a makeover. And he said, you need cut down to size. It's like he heard me. What the heck? Creepy. OK. Looks like you need a little training. He just said it again. Ew! 
Ooh. Okay, Mr. Werewolf. Ooh, look, we're gonna go through a little haunted, haunted house time. Ah! You know, make it out alive. And survived. <laughs> oh, this is the scariest one they have here. Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> Terrifying! What does he do? Now, that was all fun and games, but we all know the real reason that we're here today, which is to go fidget hunting. So let's go look up by the registers, because that's where I heard they are, and we'll see if they have any Halloween fidgets. I am so excited. All right, let's see you guys. Whoa, look at all of this stuff. <gasps> what? I'm trying to feel everything up to see if it has a cool texture. Wait, guys. These are absolutely fidgets. They call them squishy mice. Um, they have a really cool texture to them. Ew. These are absolutely disgusting. Even if these were fidgets, I would never buy them. That's so disgusting. Cockroaches, ew. Black spiders. They have spider rings. I'm trying to find anything that has like a cool texture. Ooh, are these squishy? No, they're like, ping pong balls except their eyeballs. More spiders. Ooh, wait. Glow sticky eyes. Okay. These don't really look like eyes to me, but they're kind of like mochis. They're even packaged like mochis. They have these little skeletons. Not a fidget, but still. Hairy spiders, ew. Ooh, guys, they have little mini slimes. That is so fun for party favors. So technically this would be a fidget, but before I get them, I'm going to see what else they have. Ooh, wait, what are these? Is this squishy? Oh, guys, this would totally count. Look at this. It's a squishy snake. It has a really, really cool feeling to it. I can't even describe it. And there's different colors. So I got to pick my favorite snake. Ew. I don't know if I could pick a favorite. I'll try to pick the least scary. Ew. I don't know, guys. They have a really, really neat feeling though. Okay, this is where the really cool fidgets are at. Oh my goodness. So they have Flarp Noise Putty in multiple different colors. <gasps> no way. Oh my gosh. So they have this egg splat ball. I have the tomato version of this and it's absolutely a fidget toy. So I am going to add this to our little basket right here confidently. What's this? cotton candy. I don't know what that is. I thought it was slime or something, but they have mini brands. So, so tempted to get one. Um, what else? Bubbles. They have more of these ping pong ball eyes. A whoopee cushion. Ew, gross. Okay, these would definitely be fidgets, but I don't even think I could get them. They're squishy, but they're just disgusting, and yeah, I don't. Um, Ooh, is this glow in the dark putty? I think I need this. This is totally Halloween and definitely a fidget. Comment below how many times I've said the word fidget in this video. What's this? Mad Lab. So this is like, this is slime. Oh my gosh, it doesn't end. Guys, they have Neetos, like actual Neetos. Are you kidding me? Wow, okay, so they have the pink one, they have the purple, and the green so if we get one of these it's definitely gonna have to be the green one because i don't have just a solid green needle in my collection and this is the most halloweenish color that they have so we're gonna add that they've got silly string some fun cups more noise putty which why don't we add the orange color to the basket oh they have a rainbow slinky ah guys i wonder how much only 2.99 Okay, that's not bad and it's super pretty cool oh i thought these were globbles at first they're bouncy balls um noise putty on a keychain and then they have a whole bunch of glow sticks let's see am i missing anything what's this squish dude oh wait he's me how did i not see this oh my gosh i think i need this it's so random and it just screams fidget. Like we're gonna have to try this out together to see if it actually stretches the way it shows in the picture. What do you guys think? When I'm done checking out, I will definitely do a little haul for you guys in the car. So stay tuned for that. 
and we are out. I got the goods. I can't wait to open everything up. Spirit Halloween haul at the Learning Express parking lot. Yes, we are all over the place today, you guys. But um, fun fact, my phone is actually being balanced on my steering wheel right now. So yeah, up close and personal, but we are here for it. So I spent almost $40 inside of the store and I found some really fun and unique things that I am so excited to share with you guys. Even though I kind of showed you everything inside of the store, we need to test some of these things out like right here, right now, duh. So I am so eager to see what this guy is all about, okay? They call him the squish dude. So we're gonna open him up ASAP and we're gonna see if he lives up to his hype because look at that. Like, honestly, wait, is that him that smells? Oh my gosh, he smells divine. Okay, so his arms are supposed to stretch and stretch and stretch and stretch. Okay, he so he can go about that far. Yeah, not bad. Ooh, okay, so I love the way that this feels and smells. I need to work at like a factory that makes things like this because I just want to capture this scent in a jar and smell it all the time. Um, yeah, anyways, so it feels like he has sand on the inside and there's just something about this that I just love. So it's a different type of texture and I don't have any fidgets like this. So I'm going to give our squish dude a literal 10 out of 10. I'm obsessed. And by the way, what should we name him? Um, let me know in the comments and the best name suggestion will get their comment pinned. Then we got this neon green Neato and I'm actually going to be keeping this in the packaging because I'd like to include it in maybe like a flash giveaway or something like that in the future for one of you guys. Because while I do love this and I find it super fun, I have so many other like neato fidgets in my collection. I don't have this exact color, but I think I'm going to save it to give to one of you guys. Then we have these glow sticky eyes and okay, these reminded me of mochis just like Halloween edition. Cause look, okay, they come individually packaged just like mochis do. And then, whoa, OMG, this feels like a booger in the best way possible. It's like a frog eye. They should have called them frog eyes. That would have made more sense. I wasn't expecting it to feel so much like literal snot. I don't know why I'm smelling it. I swear I seriously have a sniffing disorder, but okay. <laughs> I'll stop now. I'm going to try to refrain from snipping it again. These feel really, really neat. Um, I'm really happy that I got them and I am going to be giving these away to you guys as well. Like when I do lives and things like that, then, oh, I'm so excited about this. Okay. So this is called a splat ball egg. Again, as I mentioned in the store, I have a splat ball tomato that I actually got from Learning Express. It legit looks like after you crack an egg. This would be like a good prank, honestly. And P.S. It smells great. Like it smells so new. I'm just gonna throw it against the window. It's probably gonna make my phone fall cause it's balancing, like barely balancing right now, but <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, it just, <laughs> it skipped right back onto my lap here. I'll show you guys. Ah! Oh, Schnitzelbacher, I knew that was gonna happen. Dang. Okay, now, now I've got a dirty egg that I have to go find under my seat. Um, yeah, fun stuff. Anyways, then I got a package of rats. Like what? Oh, <gasps> wait, they have that really cool texture as well. Kind of like what that blue dude had. Listen, you can like hear the feel of it. Does that make sense? Like. Ooh, these are so fun. So I'm just gonna be keeping one for myself and then again, I'm going to be doing little giveaways with the rest of them because I do not need 100,000 rats in my fidget bin, but one will be just fine. Then we have a rainbow slinky and I love the packaging of this. It looks so enticing and exciting. Woo, look at this, it's brand spanking new. Look at all the colors, like. Comment below what your favorite color is just for funsies. Wow, this is absolutely mesmerizing. I think there are maybe one or two more things left inside of the bag. Yeah, two more things. So both of these are slime related. So we have this orange 
Flarp Putty. I wish Callie were here with me right now because she would have opened this first thing. She would have been having a lot of fun with this because, well, it makes fart noises. So, you know what? We're going to open it. It is quite humorous. All right, you ready, guys? Oh, that one was a struggle. <laughs> oh my gosh, wait. Okay, I gotta do that one more time. It's kind of addictive. <laughs> oh, all right, go back in there. I'm done with your games. I can't get it back in. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Woo, dang, that was something. All right, and then lastly, we have this Night Glow Putty Egg, and I am not going to be opening this right now because it's bright and sunny outside, and we would not be able to see it glow. So I'm going to save this for later tonight, and I'm so excited to see it glow. So guys, I have to say, my favorite find of the day was this blue stretchy guy. I think he's so fun, and I also really loved the splat egg that's um, probably sizzling under my seat right now because it's actually so hot outside. Don't let my long sleeve shirt fool you. It's actually, fun fact, it's October 1st as I'm filming this. So I am completely done with my summer wardrobe, even if today technically feels like a day in June, like a warm sunny day in June. I don't care. I'm done with it. I'm over it. And I am in full fall mode, baby. Full fall mode. But Anyways, you guys, that was all for today's video. If you enjoyed it, then please don't forget to give it a big giant thumbs up. And yeah, I love you guys so much. And I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye. Mwah.